America's Army remains highly capable and mission ready by leveraging the strengths of a diverse all-volunteer force that includes more than 57,000 Asian American and Pacific Islanders. They are a vital part of the legacy of professionalism, selfless service, dignity, and respect, and continue this legacy today while inspiring generations to come. This afternoon's guest speaker is part of that legacy. Please give a warm welcome to Major Hyung Suk Ji, who serves as the primary dentist at the Ansbach Dental Clinic. Thank you, sir. Good afternoon, everybody. Uh, I had a lot of uh, speech and, you know, those uh, seen in the movies where you get scrap a piece of paper, throw it in a trash can. Uh, the trash can, you know, I have to take out the trash. So I was like, no, I'm going to open it up again and write it over. And anyway, so I had many things, but by looking at the slides uh, when I came in, um, what can I say? Yes, I am an Asian uh, American. Uh, me joining the Army uh, was somewhat of a surprise and definitely a joke to my father. <laughs> I say that because he, was, he himself wasn't a military at all, but he worked with the military ever since he was little, growing up in Korean wartime. Um, Obviously, in 1950, he was born in 34, and makes him 83 now, and he's retired in Florida, fishing every day, 25 hours a day. Yes, there's an extra hour in the 24 hours. He only comes home to sleep and flay the fish and vacuum seal it, put it in a one out of four refrigerators that he's got, and goes back out again. So, he's not Asian anymore, he's just dark. <laughs> if you can't wait, because well, you've been suffering for two weeks, right? So what's one more day, right? So, yeah. just, please, and, and, please do that. And so my wife would not like that. And, and, and my kids, yeah. Good. Anyway, so enjoy and uh, thank you for coming and thank you, Sergeant Para, for giving me this opportunity. But thank you.